before I hop into my review, I wanted to give you guys kind of a little first impressions situation. So I wanted to show you guys the wig in perfect condition before I even put it on. Uh, first impressions, it's absolutely flawless. As you can see, those baby hairs and the parting space and the frontal portion of this wig is just really laid out and really easy to work with those baby hairs are like a one day one so I really like that and it's got two clips in the front and a clip in the back and also two adjustable straps so all good things all good things but stay tuned for the actual review hola sonadores su bienvenido de mia en mi canal por su bienvenida de maya a mi canal Hola soñadores, su bienvenida de Maya a mi canal. <laughs> oh god, I need a tissue. Hey dreamers, it's Maya and welcome back to my channel. That's what I was trying to say and I was trying to say it in Spanish because this wig is really giving me like señorita vibes. Like really, really giving it to me so I thought I would try. But anyways, you guys, it has been a minute since I've come on here. Well, it feels like it's been a minute since I have done a wig review. And thank you so much to divatress.com for getting me back on my wig review game because, honey, you're going to want to know the details on this one. So, just jumping right into it, here we have the... It's a wig, natural hairline, synthetic frontal S lace wig, divine. And divine she is, in fact. Um, I am wearing the color two, and it is a wavy, silky, long texture, French lace, French brown lace, hand tied, 13 inch by six parting space frontal, two combs in the front, adjustable straps, and the band, like I showed you guys. And um, yeah, this wig is probably. 28 maybe 30 inches long like it's a long one so yeah here is the picture and honestly you guys like this is a really really good wig and I feel like I'm always coming on here saying that but divatrust.com literally hooks it up every single time oh also this retails for $49.95 and that's about about how much uh, Friday night hair wigs cost and that's like my other favorite brand um, but this is like right up there with Friday night hair quality and honestly the lace is a lot better so I would pick this wig over a Friday night hair uh oh we already got some tangling though so this is literally fresh out of the package I ran a brush through it um, and that's about it so right off the bat just putting it on obviously it's gorgeous but just being really honest because I've only had this wig on for about 10 minutes like oh wow honey hold on this video might take a little turn because I cannot even run my finger through that what damn that's crazy oh, oh smell. that's kind of crazy um I mean these curls are very very big and it's uh super layered but you know what i'm saying for this to be fresh out of the package i'm a little bit nervous about no um but it is really really pretty and the parting space and the baby hairs on it and all of that stuff is so a1 that it's like okay pros and cons you gotta weigh it out and decide whether it's for you or not because i didn't lay these hairs very nicely in my opinion i'm kind of in a hurry but the baby hairs are there for you to work with and slay if you know how to do it right. And I just love that I can just like flip and toss and turn this any way that I want and not have to worry about like lace looking weird and stuff like that when you glue it down. And I just really like that and I just really love the like the curl pattern in this y'all. I can't stop flipping it around. There are a million quadrillion styles you could do with this. Like I could part it down the middle and have a moment there. I can let these hang down in the front right here and do a little moment like that. Like, I could do that, honey. I could probably even put this on a ponytail. Oh, oh, we're losing some. I could do a lot with this, and that's what I really like about this, about this wig, you guys. And honestly, no matter where your hair like flows or stays, it just looks beautiful. Like, hair blowing, blowing in the breeze because we're superstars. But I will admit that it already has started tangling, like... Damn, that's the only thing. Let's check the nape of the neck. 
yeah, she is tangling, you guys. And for 50 bucks, it's like, damn it. But I personally still think it's worth it just because I know how to fix wigs left and right. And, like, I'm just... One, like, I'm satisfied with one amazing good use out of a synthetic wig, like, but I will wear this until she is down to her last thread, for real, for real. So, um, yeah. You guys have to make the decision on your own whether or not you think this wig is worth it, but in my opinion, I would give this wig, like, an 8.5 out of 10, and I only took off 1.5 points because of the tangling already. It's not crazy, and there's really not any shedding, which is nice, too. But she is tangling already, and that sucks. But she's still beautiful. So yeah, that's my tea on this wig, you guys. I'll give this video a thumbs up, and just be ready for more wig reviews this year. Okay? Okay. <laughs> what I'm going to do is be super extra, and I'm going to do my best to maintain this in the best condition possible. So I'm just gonna take some extra measures as far as maintaining it. So tonight, because my edges are laid so nicely, I want to put it into two French braids and just tie it down and just be extra and take care of it that way. So that's what we're gonna do tonight and I think that this is gonna be a good tip to share with you guys if it's just extra laid and snatched. You want it to remain the same. Also, you could do two space buns. Two space buns would keep the curls nice. I think I, I could do that. Because I like how the ends naturally are like straight. It's like a curl and it's straight. <laughs> We're not going to do that.